हिमांशु आपको बहुत बहुत बधाई you you come from a physics background you got uh, uh, good selections at at uh, i don't recall the university i think you can answer that question and uh, uh, yes kaha kaha selection thank you so much thank you so much for your uh, words uh, i i got a fully funded admission from university of central florida Mm-hmm. and i also got another admit from university at albany that was in ms so i selected university of central florida for my future career yeah. and it was also your dream university i would say you, you yes sir on, my... you you keep on saying sir i, I want you see yes UCF, sir UCF. it's my first priority sir and i got this university with the help of you and your team thank you so much yes. for this yes you welcome so let's have a discussion a short of we want to know about you राइट uh, फ्रॉम right कहा आपका जन्म हुआ कहा पढ़ाई की आपने uh, आपका हाई स्कूल बीएससी एमएससी क्या व्हाट यू वांट डिस्कस गो बेसिकली आई एम हिमांशु फ्रॉम नरवाना ए स्मॉल टाइम ऑफ डिस्ट्रिक्ट जींद हरियाणा Okay. i completed my secondary education and higher secondary education from st senior secondary school darwana with the percentile 95 and 85 percentile respectively okay. uh, after that i moved to rgst college which is situated in the same hometown darwana from there i completed my bachelor's education with uh, uh, almost uh, 72 percentile after when that did i you moved start and when did you finish your bsc uh, i started in 2014 and completed in 17 okay And after that, after that, I joined Masters of Physics from Kurukshetra University campus. Mm-hmm. From there, I completed my Masters in 2020 uh, with a CGP of 8.85. Okay. And soon after that, I took admission in the B.Ed. And along with that, I start apply uh, for the uni- U.S. universities, and it was my dream in my passive mind. So yes. in the meanwhile, I meet you, and uh, then yes. process. Uh, I and everything is in. history. <laughs> yes. <laughs> did you have any, by the way, any research experience uh, during your BSc and MSc? No, sir. I have no research experience during my bachelor's or my masters. I just simply did uh, the lab work, which is done in almost any all universities. Many students, uh, after completion of a masters, they try uh, NET, JRF, or GATE exams. Did you qualify any of those examinations? Yes, sir. Earlier, I was thinking to join uh, PSUs after qualifying GATE exam. I also mm-hmm. prepared for, but well, unluckily, I did not get too much good rank in mm-hmm. that exam. And later on, I also tried uh, admission in uh, some NITs and IITs. But during mm-hmm. that process, I met you, and so yeah. as I told, my passive dream was uh, yes. to pursue higher education from the abroad. So I uh, took that path. Okay. Good. Very good. Yeah. it is not required and not necessary you have to waste your time in many ways in preparation of nat gr even no, it and also helped me in my gr physics exam yeah. my whole preparation yes very true some way or other to so, kab socha aapne uh, when you started thinking that you want to explore us for your phd program yes sir actually sir ye mera dream tha jab main masters mein tha usi time se but mm-hmm. uh, i had no experience no guide proper guidance that how to apply foreign universities as you know mm-hmm. it, the process is entirely different and mm-hmm. you have to do many exams and different different things mm-hmm. uh, to apply for the admission so during my masters mera plan tha abroad country se masters uh, phd karne ka but uh, us time wo successful ho nahi paya tha after masters se covid bhi aa gaya tha us duran aur yes. maine bed mein admission le liya tha mm-hmm. and along with my bed i start applying to the uni- us universities uh, with the yes. your guidance Yes, true. So, आपने obviously uh, you contacted. How did you know uh, about about us? Uh, who told us? Uh, who told you about us? Uh, basically, for initial, no one told me. I got your video on YouTube, and on the okay. same day, I almost watched ten to twenty video <laughs> of your YouTube <laughs> channel. And later on, I contacted a few uh, students from the. the videos as you gave their linkedin profile in the description box mm-hmm. and later mm-hmm. on uh, i also contacted a super senior my as i told you ravinder ravinder yes from uh, he is also in the same university <laughs> yes sir he is in the same university and same department <laughs> and so i confirmed that uh, i can proceed with you so you have no doubts uh, about joining our 
treatment. No, sir. I contacted so many students, and everyone is saying that the person is genuine. You can prefer. Mm. You can do so. There is no point of yes. fraud or anything See, else. You did not waste a single day. I think. <laughs> no, sir. Within a one week, I decided uh, to pursue yes. with you. Yes. So, uh, yeah. Let's talk about this part. Of what examination did you take uh, to put through your applications? Uh, as earlier you told me to took three exams. Uh, first is about the language proficiency test, mm -hmm. TOEFL or IELTS. Okay. I took the IELTS exam and got six point five in this exam. Six point five. Uh, yes, six point five. How did you prepare? How did you prepare? Uh, mainly, I prepared uh, through YouTube videos and uh, some official book of the IELTS, and okay. I also took some online mocks. It was not so much difficult exam for me, I, mm -hmm. so. I, yeah, okay. Uh, uh, do you remember different sections? Man? What were your scores? Exactly, to nahi yada, sir, but I think uh, I got 7.5 in listening, 7 mm -hmm. in uh, writing, 7 in uh, 6 in reading, and 6 or 5 in speaking. Almost speaking. there. Almost there. Uh, 6.5 is sufficient, anyways. Yes, sir. To have uh, those kind of uh, yes, admits. And, uh, and later on, I appeared for the GRE Physics on, in the month of uh, October, and mm -hmm. I got 780 marks out of 990. How did you prepare for Physics GRE? Uh, as I told you earlier, said that I was preparing for the GATE exam and all other exams, and I also prepared for the JAM exam. These mm -hmm. old stuff also helped me, and okay. your guidance that you told uh, you how to prepare, how to crack, uh, how to... Uh, attack on the exam specifically on the to the point so that it's a very lengthy exam not difficult but mm -hmm. it's very tricky you have to save time in during the exam mm -hmm. so you told me those tricks and the, also one book uh, name uh, inquiring the physics that also helped me okay so, so it was simple i prepared for yeah. one and two basically uh, 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 the study material you have from jam preparation and net jrf gate everything Putting together yes, sir. some uh, whole uh, whole exam is basically depend on the basics of the physics, physics. problems. Uh, I agree with you. It's not difficult examination. You need to practice those concepts, and, and I think probably just you need bound. to some uh, practice and uh, how to manage the time during the exam. Himanshu, do you remember that how many questions were uh, were, were right? Probably, if you recall, remember. Uh, sure, there were a total hundred of questions, and uh, as they did not told, tell about their, they only told about the result, didn't tell about mm. the, how many questions are correct or incorrect, mm. and just give the percentile that you got uh, 70% yeah. in classical mm. mechanics, 75% mm. in quantum. So they don't mm. tell about the specific how many correct and incorrect answers. No, they did not tell, but we have our gut feeling, right? How many? Uh, what do I, you think? I think uh, I think uh, that must be around seventy plus. About seventy plus, you know, out of around 100. seventy plus. Yeah. out it's of hundred good, questions. It's a good number. Your score was very good. Yes, anything close to seven seven hundred or seventy uh, is a good score. Okay? Yes. Yeah, that helps you in in many ways. You did not take general GRE examination. No, sir. I did not take as I uh, took the. Uh, GRE physics exam in October and after that I appeared in December 3rd of December for IELTS so I mm -hmm. had no sufficient time for that time. and you said that you can appear for yeah. without yeah, GRE yeah. physics as it yeah. is waived off in many universities. It is not, it's not required completely. Uh, I agree. How many applications you put or kahan kahan se selections aapke paas mein? Uh, I applied uh, around 8 universities Okay. And got admit from two. One is from for PhD, uh, mm -hmm. University of Central Florida. It's yes. fully funded, and another is for MS uh, that I uh, declined the offer. To check my offer letter, go at letsdogre.com. So tell us about uh, uh, UCF, University of Central Florida. Why uh, uh, you like this university so much that you were desperate to have a selection at UCF? So my first concern is about sir my health. Uh, I don't like too much cold as okay. due to my health problems. So I mm -hmm. initially I told you that I should choose only those university. Their temperature is not in too much minus mm -hmm. minus ten degree. Okay. So <laughs> okay. that came to University of Texas and Florida. These are two environment friendly environment. states for that, me. 
and okay. later on i dis uh, viewed the profile and as i contacted uh, ravinder sir my super mm -hmm. senior he mm -hmm. also told me that it's very good university having good faculty and research mm -hmm. and instrumentation so i finalized my first priority as university of central florida yeah right, right. i mean he's a nice person ravinder. yes sir sure. yes yes or uh, tell us about your scholarship that you received at ucf Uh, I am receiving the trustee doctor fellowship from University of Central Florida and mm. it will cover my whole expenses including tuition fees, housing and health insurance. It's mm. uh, 25k for a year and almost 2100 per month uh, covering my whole expenses. Very nice. Bad, bad, bad it also includes tuition waiver which is a huge amount. Yeah, thank you. It's because of you and your oh, team. Uh, thank you. Over the time, let's say five years or so, they're gonna uh, support you near to two to three crore Indian rupees. A lot of efforts and uh, take this opportunity yes, very sir. seriously to groom yourself as a scientist, I would say, and learn many things sure, and sir. contribute to the society the way you want to do. Yeah. So sure. what's your research interest at UCF? Uh, as they are giving a uh, facility to decide the research interest after completing the coursework. Mm -hmm. so in, Yet now I have not decided too much, but uh, I will go through the condensed matter physics. Condensed matter. That's that's uh, that's key part. So tell us about uh, our uh, contribution to your success right from beginning until you have these couple of offers. I think uh, this whole uh, thing is possible just because of you and your team, as I told them many many times yes. uh, it's because without the proper guidance you just only have your grades your exams and your dmcs and you can't do anything mm -hmm. with them yes guidance is coffee important has sir and specifically higher education and ob usa jaisi countries may so mm -hmm. coffee helpful happy aapka guidance you prepared an official cv for me and guided me that how to uh, write a proper sop so called yes. mini biography and yes. uh, how to approach professors regarding mm -hmm. letter of recommendations and mm -hmm. um, how to shortlist universities because sometimes it happens that uh, many good students do not get admission because yes. they choose their wrong universities. Yeah, very true. I, I agree with you. You brought up so it's, a great point. Yeah, shortlisting universities is, is key aspect to get the key. selection. Yeah, yeah. I remember one, it, of, one of the students, pretty nice, pretty good student, when he came to me and I was just surprised. He didn't get, get any, any admission. Yes, sir. I also met so many people on LinkedIn that they didn't yeah. get any admission and yes, they have yes. much better profile than me. Yes, yes. Very true. Okay. So, uh, let's talk about emotions. Uh, once you received this offer, how did you feel? Did you believe it? <laughs> no, sir. It was completely unbelievable and it was totally amazing and I did not sleep a whole night and at the same time I still remember I got in the midnight and at the same time I sent the offer letter to you and mm -hmm. luckily you are also online on the WhatsApp and you <laughs> told me that call me right now then later on we discuss about the whole thing yeah. and initially it was I'm, I think uh, it's not fully funded. So you told me that the funding will come later and uh, yeah. you guided me about the further steps. Very true. I completely agree, uh, agree with you. You have to have patience. It's, yes. It's sir. important. Uh, don't it's a long patience. time around. Yeah, it, you have to pay six yeah, to eight you months be, during. Uh, you got to have patience depending on the things we are doing. Let's talk about expense. Jab se jude aap or, uh, selection oh, I did not count, sir, but I can give an overview. Yes, and yes, yes. First one is about uh, for appearing the IELTS exam. It cost mm -hmm. you around fifteen to sixteen thousand, mm -hmm. and in the similar way, GRE physics it again cost you around fifteen to sixteen thousand. Mm -hmm. And the next one is about your transcript, and I also gone through the WES evaluation. That is also mm -hmm. a little bit costlier process, uh, costing you around 20 25k. Mm -hmm. And uh, apart from this, I apply to seven universities, and each university will cost around six to seven k. Mm -hmm. So around fifty k for applying university, yes, and yes. plus your fees also. Yeah. Yes, yes. And. Uh, Next steps are like service fees and the yeah. US application fees. These are still pending. So around yeah. 50 for, K for them. Yes. So close to, I think, yeah. 
two lakh, I think, before it, a visa uh, two process. Two and two point two five, almost. Five. Yes, yes, uh, completely agree. Uh, a number of students they ask maybe I need twenty lakh rupees, thirty lakh rupees. So I, I feel like asking this question to students, making sure others they should know that it is not the case. Uh, just, uh, yes, sir. Earlier, earlier I was also thinking that it will cost me around 20 or 30 lakh because in <laughs> the all student are in a phase that they have yeah. to pay more and more, more mm -hmm. expenses will be required yes. for yeah. abroad study, but they are not aware about the funding yeah. and the yeah. old stuff. They are not aware. Awareness is very important. Going yes, sir. Awareness and proper guidance. guidance. And yeah. 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 Very true, sir. So that's the way it is, sir. बहुत बहुत बधाई आपको अभी तो आपका आई ट्वेंटी भी आ गया एंड आई थिंक वी आर ऑलरेडी इन प्रोसेस डीएस वन सिक्सटी आपने कंप्लीटेड एंड वी आर लुकिंग नाउ फॉर यू सबमिटेड द फी टू टुडे राइट और अभी यस राइट टुडे आई सबमिटेड यस सो इट विल बी एक्टिवेटेड बाय टुमारो एंड वी लुक फॉर योर स्लॉट्स डिजाइन � May and then we help you through uh, various steps of preparation of you know, visa. That's important. Sure. Part. Yes, yes. We all message of Dena Chai, Bursary student. I think we have so many students coming from your region, especially Haryana. So I have a specific message to only those aspirants who are planning for abroad studies that at least they should have to contact at least your uh, Let's Do GRE platform. It's a very good platform and they should try again and again, have patience and at least once they should try about their dreams, uh, it's not uh, uh, too far after contacting you and yes. it's my simple message to all of them. Good. Thank you so much, Himanshu. I wish you uh, all the best. And we're gonna thank you, thank you so soon. much. Yeah. I hope your blessings will always stay with yeah. me yeah. throughout thank the you. life. Yes, yes, yeah, it's gonna be. Uh, we're gonna help you in, in many ways, uh, even yes. uh, after reaching US. I mean, many students. They, yes, they are sure, student I will be in yes. contact you. And especially your major is also physics. <laughs> yes, yes, sir. Same as you. Okay, Take care. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Sir.